What's happening, folks? Back with another reaction, back with some more acid techno, and back with some more acid dub techno. And we're going to listen to the latest AAA release, which I didn't even realize uh, until uh, Chris brought it to my attention uh, that it had been released. So, yeah, this is 2024. I'm trying to remember the number in the uh, AAA series. Does it say it clearly here? A 13. So the 13th, it's a lot of, you know, last few years they've been putting these out um, at a rapid rate. So shout out to Chris, as well as to all the artists. And as I mentioned, it's cool that it sort of features a, a younger generation, you know, not the Godfathers, but people who've collaborated with some of the Godfathers and people who've, um, you know, been championing the acid techno sound now for years themselves. So big shout out to them, including to Jared Nesbitt here. And we're going to listen to uh, Ganja Man, which uh, I did hear a little snippet of um, before doing this reaction, but I have not heard um, entirely through. And not only is it an acid dub tune, but it feels like um, having uh, perhaps worked with some of those uh, godfathers, uh, that Nesbitt has picked up a bit of the, the jaw scoop geezer touch because the, the part of the track that I heard could have been a jaw scoop tune. It very much had that sound. So let's get to it. This is Nesbitt and his tune Ganja Man from the uh, 13th AAA release, Acid Artist in Action, a sub label run by Chris, uh, Chris Liberator of the Stay Up Forever um, collective. And yeah, this is, as I said, Ganja Man from 2024.
but can be a set ender. Um, and yeah, it reminds me a bit of the... Was it just called Rudy? I should remember if it was just called Rudy. Um, but the tune, the acid dub tune on the second Bitches Witches EP, which I have reacted to. In the moment, I'm... Oh, it's Bubless. It's a tune by Bubless. Um, in that, like... It's not like the craziest, fullest, you know, like lots of vocal samples, lots of like, you know, actual like toasting like in the track, but it's, it has all, you know, it's got the keys, it's got the brass, it's got the smooth feel of the sort of acid, you know, reggae sound. Um, so it's one of those tunes that like can keep the vibe of a set going, even if it's not like the one of the marquee like tracks that like you remember because you remember like the vocal sample and so on it's more of like a you know a workman like track within the context of acid dub techno so uh big shout out to that big shout out to nesbit once again as well as to chris uh massively appreciate him you know keeping me apprised of uh, what's going on in the acid artisan action label in particular but just you know the stay up forever um, collective at large, uh, and ultimately I always appreciate the little handwritten notes that he puts in, um, and he mentioned, like, with this uh, invoice in the handwritten note, that like, oh, you're really gonna like this AAA, so, uh, first track, definitely on board with it, so, seems like that is very much gonna be the case, but I've mentioned, like, the quality and consistency of the AAA series, like, in some of my reviews of the records on Discogs, um, it's definitely notable, you know, it's been... Um, solid muckraking acid techno and also acid dub um, from the off. So yeah, big shout out once again to Chris as well as to Nesbitt. Let me know what you think and Luca the sleeping, alternatively sleeping and stretching cat uh, and I will see you next time. Peace.